Villard noted, for a long time, the experts have been debating ways to make the wheel turn autonomously. But despite all this effort, the same conclusion always arises. Something always gets in the way. The physics behind the problem. Why don't perpetual motion machines work? The answer lies in physics, the first and second laws of thermodynamics, to be precise. Thermodynamics laws are the principles in physics that explain how various forms of energy interact. The first law says energy cannot be created or destroyed. You can only transform it. So, even in the best case scenario, a perpetual motion machine could never produce more energy than what you put in. What do you think is the most significant energy loss in machines? Heat, sound, or friction? And then there's the second law, which essentially says that energy disperses over time. That's why, in reality, no machine can run indefinitely. Energy will always be lost through heat and friction, even in the most perfect system.